Fight on Cannibalism Part 1. If you like this video, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel and share this video. The invasive Burmese python is an opportunistic feeder, and when stalking its prey, the snake makes no obvious distinction between preying on a harmless rabbit or a potentially dangerous predator such as the American alligator. Alligators are apex predators, and a small gator might not survive the attack of a large python, but it won't be an easy kill compared to mammals or birds, which only takes a few minutes to asphyxiate. Feeding on an alligator requires a huge amount of energy and can last for hours due to its resilient nature. And to make matters worse, alligators are capable of lowering their heart rate down to 1 or 2 beats per second, which might cause the python to think its prey is dead, when in fact the alligator is still alive. Recording the grim scene of a dead alligator protruding from a python's body is a rare occasion indeed. The young alligator might have clawed its way out of the snake and killing it in the process. However, nothing goes to waste in nature and these hungry alligator will consume both cadavers. Rodents make far less dangerous prey to feed upon. They are usually killed in minutes and swallowed fast, giving that no other predator interrupts the feeding. Cannibalism is not uncommon in the snake world. Coral snakes, water magazines and many other snakes feed frequently on its own kind. Yet. Such behavior has rarely been observed with Burmese pythons. It is obvious that the larger python was attracted by the smell of the dead rat, killed by the smaller python, which only needed to drop its prey in order to survive the attack. A hungry Burmese python will not hesitate to kill its own species in the battle for food. The dominant snake coils its powerful body around the smaller python in order to asphyxiate it. In the majority of snake species only one lung is functioning, yet it still took over half an hour to kill the weaker python. Snakes are extremely vulnerable during feeding and the winner will make sure that its opponent is dead before devouring its prey.
After eating the rat, the python continues swallowing its 9 foot attachment. The bonus of a double kill is obvious, but it also requires a tremendous amount of energy to feast on such large meal. Its prolonged feeding time also increases the risk of attracting other predators. The whole sequence lasted more than 3 hours and the python took a long rest during the feeding, but it was unable to swallow the entire cadaver and the tip of the tail kept hanging out of its mouth when disappearing. If you like this video please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel and share this video. Thank you for watching.